What is up here YouTube? Jigsaw0097 here. I have to make this video because it's just come to a head now. Skip Bayless might be the biggest idiot in sports journalism. We got this guy and freaking Stephen A. Smith and Shannon Sharp. These guys are all bloviating jackasses and I'm really, really tired of listening to it. So this was really just uh, the final straw where I had to say something. This guy really is an idiot. We all know Skip Bayless is an absolute moron and most of what he says and if not all of what he says can just be taken as complete BS and biased opinion because we know that this guy is the biggest Cowboys fanboy apologist. He won't even look at facts. He just looks at the fact that the dude's wearing the star and then all of a sudden he's the greatest thing ever. You guys remember him saying how Tony Romo was the greatest quarterback to ever live and all this stupid crap back in the day. But basically the reason I'm making this video is because today he said that Carson Wentz when he gets pressure, looks like a deer in the headlights. His quote, deer in the headlights. It's like, did you even watch that Arizona game? There were several plays where the Arizona Cardinals were using blitz packages. We're talking six to seven guys rushing him. And Carson Wentz showed more poise than I've seen on an Eagles quarterback since like Donovan McNabb in like the mid-2000s. So I don't want to hear this crap that he looks like a deer in the headlights. And then you watch the Green Bay game with Dallas. Dak Prescott looked like the deer in the headlights. Without Ezekiel Elliott, that dude is nothing. He throws balls off point. Um, he, makes, he makes ridiculous under-pressure throws where he just lobs it up. He doesn't even look where he's throwing it. And Dallas lost. I mean, it's, it's in the record, Skip. Eagles, W. Dallas, L. It's that simple. So yeah, guys, um, got a little annoyed about that. Just wanted to make this because I'm, I'm just so tired of Skip Bayless. He's one of the most overrated sports journalists. One of the biggest idiots. I mean, I don't even know how this guy got famous. I mean, I know he covered the Cowboys and he wrote like a book about them or some crap like that. And that's how he got famous. So suddenly he's qualified to say whatever the hell he wants on air. But I, I just couldn't believe it. I mean, you literally, th this was the proof, guys. Like, you literally can't prove this guy wrong he's he's he'll just say things that aren't fact he'll just he'll just basically use his opinion and say it's fact when it's like you look at the stats you look at the fact that the eagles literally are leading the nfc not the nfc east the nfc in time of possession and carson wentz looks like a deer in the headlights i mean it's like come on dude the guy went for a nine minute drive against the cardinals I mean, I didn't see Dallas do that. I saw Dallas lose a game to Aaron Rodgers in the last 40 seconds. Um, so there's that. But anyway, guys, that's my rant for the day. I did make a couple other videos, but, you know, I just had to get this out. What do you guys think about Skip Bayless? Do you think he's scum like I do? Are you tired of listening to this Shannon Sharp, this undisputed, this stupid first take crap? I don't even watch this stuff anymore. I just happen to see it, and it makes me stupider every time I do. So... Anyway, guys, this has been Jigsaw0097. Carson Wentz is a stud. Don't listen to the analysts. They're all idiots. And I will talk to you guys later, probably after the Thursday game.